Metal up guys, this is CJ with CJOrtiz.com and MetalMotivation.com. This is the first of a new five message series I'm doing on how to create more personal energy. Now this is all being shown in my Life Domination online coaching program and you can learn more about that if you visit the link below. How to create more personal energy. Let's face it, we all suffer from a loss of energy. You get tired, you get worn out, you get stressed, you get burnout. And you may be in any one of those positions in life. It seems like the older that we get, the more difficult it is for us to cultivate energy. Now, this is something that I've been going through even in my own life as I'm well into my middle age years. And I had no idea the sort of physical challenges that were going to arise. Everything from the mental to the emotional to the physical and no one is excluded from this sure there are those who have natural energy there are those who just seem to be hyper those who are add or what have you they seem to have this boundless sense of energy i know several people like that who will never drink a cup of coffee because it would put them into overdrive but for most of us, we do need that cup of coffee in the morning. For most of us, we do need coffee throughout the day or we need extra naps or we need something else to try and compensate for the fact that we are struggling to have enough energy. Now, what is energy? Energy is having enough, the strength and vitality required for sustained physical or mental activity. I'm going to say that again. It's the strength and vitality required for sustained physical or mental activity. That's what energy is. And no matter what it is you're facing in life, everything requires mental and physical energy. I mean, let's face it, anything that you are encountering in life that you feel like is too insurmountable, that you're never going to be able to overcome, whether it's a goal or a deadline or an area of life you need to change it may seem like it's too high a mountain for you to climb but could your physical body actually do all the steps that are necessary to do what you think is so difficult to do of course of course your physical body can do the work of course your mind can do the work that needs to be done it is overwhelming in our minds but let's face it then that will attack our sense of energy that will attack our sense of personal power the physical energy to sustain any physical activity or mental activity over an extended period of time we need energy energy to deal with our loved ones kids spouses energy to deal with work and all the issues related there energy to get up and and go to the gym or do whatever when we don't feel like doing it. energy to get everything that we need to get done accomplished for that we're going to need energy now it's often common in personal development or motivational type of teaching is that everybody limits it to the mind. In other words, you know, we've got to get you all motivated in your thinking and think positive and all of that, and you're going to have some, you're going to release some boundless energy. Now, let me say right now at the outset, I am not going to isolate it to that. You are not going to hear from me just meddle up. You are not going to hear from me that you need to just think positive. Now, thinking is going to be a part of it, when we get towards the end of this particular series, but a lot of what I'm going to talk about are the things that would really affect your energy the most. They are, have nothing to do with medicine, nothing to do with supplements, nothing to do with any of that. It's going to have to do with natural things. So throughout this, this particular series, I want to talk about your diet. I want to talk about how you can take steps to, uh, to formulate a diet in your life that is really going to start to release energy in a way you've never experienced it before and take it from me. I went through this personal transformation myself and it is probably the single greatest personal revolution in my life since I was in my early 20s. And I, and I don't say that without exaggeration. The, the diet that I have been on has, has revolutionized my life in so many ways. I want to talk about exercise. I want to, you know, you seem, well, if we expend energy doing exercise, doesn't that deplete us of energy? Actually, no. You can renew yourself 
with exercise. You can do so much for yourself mentally, physically, and emotionally through exercise. I want to talk to you about sleep. Sleep is a huge one. I mean, if I had to, to come down to one of the number one things, in some ways, it's, it's almost more important than diet in a way, in terms of energy, is sleep. And this is something that people covet. There's people with insomnia, you know, people who really, really struggle getting to sleep. And, you know, sleep has been something that I've dealt with for a very long time. And I'm even right now in the stages of, of experimenting with my own body and getting to some new breakthroughs that I've, I've just seen what the difference has made in my own life. And I think some of these things may help you as well. So I'm talking about diet. I want to talk about exercise. I want to talk about sleep. And then I want to finish by talking about the energy leaks, the things that, that we do to drain energy. Sometimes we don't need necessarily more energy. We need to stop draining our energy through things that aren't even physical. Emotion, anxiety, stress, negative thinking. That's where we will get into the realm of the mind and the emotions. But so much of it has to do with the physical. We have got to restore your energy because there is so much more that you could do in your life, so much more that you could accomplish, so much more that you could change and become, man, if you just were able to boost your energy. And the last thing I want to do is get you drinking more coffee. I drink coffee in the morning, so I'm not faulting you for that. I'm just saying you don't need to live off of that stuff. But to do this, increase energy without having to take some sort of uh, uh, synthetic thing to give you boost throughout the day. So let's talk about that all this week and creating more personal energy for yourself. Now, if you'd like to see the rest of this series, what I'm going to encourage you to do is sign up for my Life Domination Online Coaching Program. Just visit the link below, metalmotivation.com forward slash life domination coaching. I'd love to see you there. This is CJ, the Metal Motivator. And remember, in whatever you do, don't suck. Metal up.